Hey guys, Fuzzy Knop here. Uh, in this uh, video tutorial series, I want to show you how you can take your uh, MacBook or any Macintosh Apple computer. Uh, for this, I'll be running the newest version of OS X right now, uh, 10.6. Um, but I want to show you how you can take uh, your Mac and turn it into a very viable platform for uh, security research and penetration testing or ethical hacking. So um, there's, a, there's a lot of good tools out there and you can even get it to a point where you don't even really need to use a backtrack. So one of the first things you're going to need to make sure you have is the uh, Apple SDK. So you can get it by googling for Apple SDK and um, make sure you log in and if you look under downloads you can download Xcode and what you're gonna need is you're gonna need all the C uh, libraries when you install Xcode. Uh, it's a huge download, I don't have time to, to show you, but this is also um, on your disk that came with your computer if you have it. So you can use that or you can download it from here, but um, that's sort of like a prerequisite for everything else. So make sure you have that, get that installed. If, um, if you're having trouble with it, uh, let me know. But you should be able to, to, to find out, get that installed pretty pretty easily, but you need to have that. So, second thing is um, Mac ports. You can Google for Mac ports, Mac ports excuse me, and um, what you can see is uh, wh what this does, it gives you access to a lot of good Linux tools, and it makes installing them and compiling, getting them uh, updated pretty, pretty easy. So, it's pretty easy to just download it. And now I already have it installed, but I'll go ahead and install it again. Let's see. Um, okay, so yeah, you click on your operating system, go ahead and download it. I'm gonna just save it real quick. All kinds of good stuff in there. Don't look, don't spy, okay? Um, so there's Mac ports. You can run the package and I mean it's it's pretty simple. Everyone reads that, right? There's my real name for everyone. I'm not really trying to hide it though, so oh no big deal. So it's gonna install. And most of the work you're going to do with it afterwards is going to be from the command line. So I'll go ahead and show you that. Hopefully uh, it doesn't mess up my already installed version. But um, it's going to give us access to tools like Nmap and uh, Metasploit and I mean a bunch of a bunch of good stuff, a bunch of good stuff. So do 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 do. So maybe I'll cut this out, maybe not, uh, but just sort of some like blank dead time. I'm using quick time to do the screen captures, so I'm not sure if I can trim stuff out in the middle or not. But so that's that's all the install is for Mac ports. Now what you see is uh, that's hard to see. Let me uh, get a better one. Window. Grass. Okay, good. So we can type sudo port install uh, and something like nmap. Uh, if you don't know what nmap is, maybe I'll cover it in another tutorial, but it's a great tool. So you can start, um, once you have Mac ports, you can start building like uh, all these great Linux tools into, into Mac and it's, and it's really easy, you know, you don't have to do much at all. It sort of does everything for you. See, so I type sudo port install nmap in the terminal, it's getting it, it's building it, I'll have nmap when it's done. I mean it's pretty uh it's pretty nice. So I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this uh once this finishes, I'm gonna cut this off and then uh the following videos will be different tools and getting them and installing them and we'll look at the uh the interfaces a little bit. Um well I'll go ahead and continue this uh in another video. So uh if you liked it please subscribe. Otherwise, uh thanks.